702 and new this morning an accident involving a semi and a car. It's a bad one. Two adults and a child dead. Three other kids are hurt. This happened in Polk City and our Shayla Reeves is there. What do we know? Well, we can tell you there is an infant that escaped this horrific crash with uh, really no injuries. They're expected to be okay, but there are two other children still in the hospital with serious injuries in Orlando, but of course an investigation still underway. Now let me take you right to this video. This is video of the scene we arrived to here near the intersection of State Road 33 and Dean Steel Road. It was right around midnight when the Polk County Sheriff's Office tells us a car was headed west Westbound on Dean Steel Road, failed to stop at a stop sign at State Road 33 and was struck by a semi tractor trailer and dragged about 400 feet. Now we learned a man, a woman and a child were all in the front seat of that vehicle. They have all died from injuries and again, three other children. They remain in the hospital right now. Investigators out here for hours working to collect evidence and piece together exactly how all of this happened. Now within the last couple of hours, they have towed away both the car involved and also that semi tractor trailer involved too. We learned that the driver of that tractor trailer is OK, was not hurt in all of this. And just moments ago, we did see this uh, flashing light right over here. It was actually repaired uh, by a crew that was out here on the scene. So it's unclear right now if that flashing light was actually working at the time of the crash or if it was out at the time of the crash. Certainly questions will be working to answer as uh, uh, the morning rolls on. So we'll stay on top of this story and bring you any updates here as we get them. Reporting live here in Polk City, Florida, Shayla Reeves, Fox 13 News. All right, Shayla, talk to you later. Thank you.